Chinese guy rides a horse to generate buzz, ends up falling. So you thought horseback riding meant allegedly ride by the sea? Well, apparently not in China, where this young daredevil decided to go for a death race on the streets of Laiyuan. He actually demonstrated some pretty convincing skills, cutting the flow of cars fast and furious style. However, his glorious ride didn't last too long. A few hundred meters further, he was found lying on the floor, looking severely hurt and missing his shoes. Amazingly, he got away with a mere broken arm. The crazy stuntman later explained that he had been inspired by internet videos and that he did this only to generate buzz. Well, in that case, he was more than successful. Still alive? Keep watching! Chinese rooftop climber fails at roof climbing. A Chinese climber's feelings were crushed, along with some other stuff, when he tried to scale a tall building for some selfies. Wu Yongning was apparently known for making rooftopping videos and had quite a few followers on China's Twitter knockoff Weibo. Rooftopping involves climbing tall city buildings without safety equipment, and of course, endless selfies are mandatory. Wu was participating in a rooftopping challenge on November 8th for prize money when the rooftop turned out to be too challenging. While trying to do some pull-ups rather than dominating the skyscraper, they were scraping him off 62 stories below. Guess that's what happens when you live life on the edge. You fall off sometimes. Lucky guy for sure. A 20-year-old man survived falling from a fourth-story balcony over the weekend inside the famous Luxor Hotel in Las Vegas. Associated Press reported police say the unnamed man either jumped or fell from the balcony around 9.30 p.m. on Saturday. The man reportedly fell from the pyramid-shaped hotel's fourth-floor balcony, but fortunately, some of the hotel's decorations saved him before he smashed into the ground. Lucky for him, he only suffered minor injuries and was taken to a hospital for treatment. Police told the Las Vegas Review-Journal that alcohol played a role in the incident. Others who had similar experiences weren't so lucky, though, according to Las Vegas Review-Journal. In 2012, a 21-year-old California native met the floor after accidentally plunging five stories from the Cosmopolitan Hotel in Vegas. Another incident covered in the Las Vegas Review-Journal reported a 38-year-old man also accidentally plunged nine stories off the Hard Rock Hotel's balcony. Power line saves skimpily clad woman from falling to her death. A woman in China was spotted dangling from a power line in her underwear after just barely escaping splatting all over the sidewalk from five stories up. Naturally, the Chinese internet is abuzz with wild speculation that the skimpily clad woman was a mistress trying not to get caught by the wife. I guess when you're that desperate, even the window ledge outside your lover's fifth floor apartment can seem like a good idea. Until you slip and fall. Luckily, Chinese cities have plenty of power lines, and the woman managed to get caught on one. Messy death averted. But she was left hanging on a line, and quickly passed out from the shock. She's probably dying of embarrassment too, what with everything splattered all over the interwebs. But at least she's still alive. And you never know, she could have just been innocently, thoroughly cleaning her windows in her underwear like you do. Cause it's China, where anything can happen. Guess his time isn't up yet. A construction worker is lucky to be alive after a giant crane collapsed and narrowly missed him at a construction site of a future police headquarters in St. Pete's, Florida. The dramatic event occurred last Thursday morning around 8.30 a.m. when the crane's load came crashing down followed by the crane's arm. Surveillance footage shows workers scrambling from the crane which landed just a few feet from one worker. Fortunately, police say no one was injured during the incident. The Tampa Bay Times reports that the Occupational Safety and Health Administration has opened an investigation into the incident. That's a hole in one right there. Are you one of those people who looks at your phone while driving? Well, don't, or you'll end up like this guy. 
Surveillance footage from China shows this man, who was busy looking at his phone, fallen right into a giant sinkhole. The incident happened on August 17th in the city of Beihai in Guangxi. The giant sinkhole appeared just moments after the fall. According to Chinese media, the sinkhole was 32 by 16 feet wide and 6 feet deep. Given its substantial size, you would think anyone would see that it's right there. But no, this man is too busy multitasking on his phone while driving to notice the giant void right in front of him. And he plunged directly into it. Lucky for the unnamed man, he miraculously survived and made it out of the giant sinkhole with zero injuries. Footage of the video went viral, and Chinese netizens mercilessly trolled the man, with one asking how much luck someone has to have on their side to survive driving into a sinkhole. Another joke that he should have taken a selfie and posted it to social media. So far, officials in the area have not released more information on the sinkhole, like uh, what caused it. But hopefully, the footage will be a warning to all not to swipe and drive. Motorcycle meets car. Who needs brakes when there's a stopped car in front of you?